Welcome back, folks, to more Let's Play Pokemon Sword the Isle of Armor. In the last episode, uh, we evolved our uh, Cub Fu, so that's all good, into the water fighting type Urshifu, I want to say. I probably pronounced that wrong already. And now Hop's turned up on the Isle of Armor to annoy us. Oh, hey, welcome back, Mastrath. Looks like you've been at hard work keeping up your training here at the dojo, eh? Oh, Hop, you're here too. <laughs> Yeah, that sounds right. Where's the surprise, mate? The welcome? Acting like I'm something the Meowth dragged in? Well, let's be honest, you are. Y you're just how, mate. <laughs> like, I I've actually just started playing, th or I've, been, I've played through the entire main story of Pokemon Sun at this point for uh, a Let's Play later this, later this year. So, there you go. But, uh, yeah. The amount of differences, the amount of similarities between Hop and How is... Unreal. Hops better, but not by much. I'm here on the Isle of Armor to research more about the Dynamax phenomenon. So, I hear that you two are friends. How delightful. Hoppykins here. Hoppykins. <laughs> That'll be cool, yeah. Ah, oh, you nerds. Hoppykins here was just asking my permission to camp out on the Isle of Armor. But what's the fun in mucking about in the mud? I was telling him to stay here at the dojo. I mean, it'd be loads easier than camping out for a long while, but wouldn't I be in the way? Everybody's welcome to wear out their welcome at the Master Dojo. Don't be shy, my boy. Besides, we're practically family already. You're the little brother of our Leon, after all. Yeah, it's true. Lee did train here when we were both kids. Alright then, Master Mustard. You've twisted my arm. I hope you don't regret it, because I'm staying. Whoa! The more the merrier. I'm pleased as, I'm pleased as punch in a gold-plated punch bowl. Which reminds me, Master Ath. We need to get some more booze and run out. I've got something I've been meaning to tell you about Kubfu, or really its evolution, Urshifu. Yeah, I was right, I think. The truth is, the lovable rascal is capable of gigantamaxing too. But it's a bit tricky, because we can't stand the because it really can't stand the taste of Max mushrooms. So Max Soup is off the menu, unless you can make it more appealing to it. There's a certain something you can find here on the Isle of Armor, though. That'll make even Urshifu gobble up a bowl of Max Soup. And that certain something is... That certain something is... That certain something... Is it the corpses of its enemies? It's actually... The suspense here is killing me. <laughs> yeah, just a bit. What is it? Come on. Actually, I've forgotten what this is. Oopsie doopsie. I like mustard. <laughs> I like mustard. Mustard, you, can I just, like, travel around with you instead of hop? That'd be a lot better. Are you kidding me? No! <laughs> You're more fun to tease than your brother ever was. The certain something I'm thinking of is sure to make Max Soup more palatable to Urshifu. It has something to do with another Pokemon. And it is the corpses of her enemies. Fair enough. Now I think I'll let you two figure it out just what it is. Give it a good think together. You're on your own, kiddos. The world is your cloister, so get cracking. Not sure about the Pokemon puns here, but regardless. Uh, is this uh, how your training usually goes? What, doing errands for Mustard? Yeah, about right. I've really got no Rapidash in this race. Why is it with all the Pokemon puns here? But even I'm pretty curious about that certain something. I think I read something about Urshifu in a book once too. It's the Wushu Pokemon, right? The book said it lives in the mountains in some far-off region. 
Oh, please tell me it's the, the Crown Tundra. That'd be nice. Be a nice bit of continuity. Does it really? Huh? You don't even know? Don't you have one, Mastrath? Yeah, I only just got it like five minutes ago. Okay, a bit more than that. Ten minutes ago. Yeah, I think I read that Urshifu is absolutely mad for something of some kind of sticky honey. Oh, uh, what? You mean the things that bears stereotypically like? Like Winnie the Pooh? Yeah, yeah, you know that. Should have changed his name to Winnie instead, really, shouldn't I? Mastrath. Honey is made from the nectar of flowers and plants, right? Yeah, if you combine bees into it. You've got to add the bees as well. So maybe we need nectar made by some Pokemon that look like flowers and plants. And if we're looking for those kinds of Pokemon, then I'd reckon we'd find lots in a forest. I'll be able to look at a Dynamax along the way, so count me in for, your exp for some exploration. There's a forest past the big marshland, right? Bet I can't, bet I can beat you, still beat you there. You probably can, because you got a bleeding head start on me, you cheat. Alright, now we're going around with Hop. Oh, good. But does he have a red bike? I don't think so. Also, Urshifu is running behind us, trying to catch up. Right now. Oh, it's doing that thing again. Don't know what's up with the controller, but it's doing that thing again. And I do not like it when it does that thing. Right, moving on. It's still doing that thing. There you go. Now we can get some watts here at least. That'd be quite nice. Wouldn't mind that. 200 watts. More watts. Watts. I got like 44,000 watts now. I got a fair amount of watts. Not as many as I've seen some people have. Like I've seen some people have like 500,000 watts. It's not that many watts. But it's still watts to me. Right. So let's go. And see what we can find. Oh, we need to go this way. To the challenge beach. Oh, item over there. A large leak. Ah, something for uh, far fetched if we wanted it. Which is fair enough if we do. So, where do I need to go here, really? I need to go to the forest. It's doing that bloody thing. Hang on. Don't know what is up with my controller right now. Really it's still doing that thing. That's really annoying to me. Stop it. Right, so I gotta go a bit upwards actually. Right, let's go. I hate this control. I I got this and it's already cocking up massively. That's a that's not a diglet, that's a Dedene. <laughs> not a diglet! Fine, you shall be the first victim to Urshifu. Uh, not really actually anything I can do to hurt Dedene, really, can I? Now, well. It's gonna get one shot off. It's gonna be an electric type move or a fairy type move. It's thunder! It missed it, because it's dumb. So I'll just go for another close combat. <laughs> Goodbye, mate! Right. Good job. Nice. I might actually get Urshifu up to uh, level 71, that. Might do. It does! Level 71 for Poe! Brilliant. Alright, so we need to go up a bit, really, don't we? Hmm. I hate this camera. Oh, I, I, I hate the control. It's really annoying to me. Do you see what's happening? It's just going round and round and round. And I don't know what's up with it. I've tried, uh, I've disconnected it now. Hang on. There we go. <laughs> That's how you sort these things, right? <laughs> Disconnect, smack it, and you're fine. I think it's here, isn't it? Yeah, forest of focus. Looks like we're in the right place. There's an emolga there. It's quite fun. And a hidden item, sticky barb, okay. And 
some more watts. Not bad. So where's Hop in this situation then? Let's go find him. Yeah, this is a, this is a, oh, item. It's a bull Nice. Oh, another hidden item there. It's a burn Kerpikern! It's number the Erpikerns! Erpikern! Right. That's Pikachu's in here, in here. Fair enough. Oh, that one's sparking like crazy, isn't it? I'll just take the 200 watts that's there and leave. Now we're into the lowlands. Where the bloody hell's hop then in this situation? Hmm. Also, the, the frame rate has, like, gone to about two right now, so we'll just avoid that. Hop's got to be around here somewhere, but where is he? He's probably at one of the entrance ways, but I just went through the wrong entrance way. Wouldn't surprise me! The game didn't decide to put Hop in all bloody entrance ways. Which would have been interesting, I guess. And I've just come back out the way I came. Oh, good. Getting lost. The fact is, I'm, I'm in the right place, aren't I? Yeah, I'm in the right place. Okay. I think it was doing that thing again as well, so... Yeah. Didn't really help, did it? Oh, and now I got into a bloody battle with a Venipede. Ah. Great. Run, run from this one. There you go. Let's reel that. Right. Oh! Get away from me, you bloody Venipedes. I've seen enough of you in this uh, DLC, if you don't mind. You know, Clara had a Venipede. Not even a Scolipede. Why are there any Scolipedes here? Seriously. Would have been interesting, wouldn't it? All right. There's Wild Tanglers. Pretty cool. There's tanglers, there's items, sticky barb again. Good. Pikachu. Fungus. I didn't go this way, did I, last time around? Alright, let's try this way. Try this way, get 200 more watts. Another Amoongus. Ah, item. Very nice. Leaf Stone. Alright, um, it's not amazing for me since, you know, not really anything I want to evolve. That's a Tangrowth, right there. <laughs> okay, just get a Tangrowth. Alongside a bunch of lead and Tangler, go ahead. Oh. Persimians. I only know that name because I, I've, I've played through Pokemon Sun recently. There you are, mate. Finally found you. You were at one of the entrances. Finally, Master, I've been waiting forever for you. Well, maybe you should have used your powers of being in all entrances to the forest, not just one. I, th I thought Glimwood Tangle was a real maze, but this place is on an entirely different level. It's so hot and humid that I'm sweating a pond over here. Sonia and I split up places to survey. And she opted for the cold and snow and all. Ah, so does that mean that we're going to be meeting Sonya at Crown Tundra? Probably. Too bad we can't somehow divide this heat up between us two. We both feel a lot bit better. Anyway, I was checking out this Forest of Focus place while I was waiting for you to show up. And I saw signs of Lilligans and Applin live here. Maybe we can gather a bit of sweet nectar that Urshifu would love from their flowers and fruits. Well, maybe, yeah. Possibly. Let's move on, though. Ooh, little petalil there. Just a little petalil. That's just a petalil. That's all it is, just a petalil. Look, it's a petalil. We know that. I just said it. Petalil evolves into Lilligant, which is just the Pokemon we're looking for. Pear. Petalil doesn't care about your sentiments, mate. 
Hey, doesn't the Petalil seem to be acting a bit strange? It looks a bit lost to me. Yeah, now that you mention it, it's still pretty little. Maybe it got separated from its parents? Hop, this is the Pokemon world. We know that Petalil only has a mother. Because it's the Pokemon world. Petalil walking is adorable. Oh, it's adorable. What can I say? Whoa! Who are you glooming on to, mate? You really must be lost if you think I'm your mum. And now I'm stuck. Okay. You gotta help us out here, Mastrath. Go find us one of Petalil's parents or something, would you? Look for some worried looking Lilligant. I'll wait here with this little one. I'm afraid it'll step I'm afraid I'll step on it if I start walking around. Urshifu would probably try and step on it. Right, okay, we gotta try and look for a, a Lilligant, have we? Fair enough. I said there's just, there's just, it, the, the, okay, so we got, hang on, we got a Mulga Pikachu, the Dene's around here in the Isle of Armor. Is this place just Pikachu ripoff city? I mean, where's, where's the rest of them? Where's Plusle and Minan? You know, where's Pachirisu? Why is there Tangrowth? Alright, so I have now got to go on a look for a Lilligant. Is it you? It's you. Apparently, it's you. I've already found you. Okay. Hello. Lily. No, she's from one of the other games. Uh, have you lost a Petalil? Lilligant. Lilligant wants to follow you, leading to where Hop and Petalil are waiting. Alright. There you are. <laughs> there you are. Come on, follow us. Follow us to where we need to go. Back to where Hop is. But can I remember the way back? I don't think it was that way. I think it might have been this way. I'm not sure though. There's an Amoongus. Don't get into a fight with the Amoongus. Ah, there's the Tangrowth. So I think we're going the right way here. I'm going this way. Where's the Lilligant? There it is. Okay. Ooh, that's a TM. That's a TM. That I certainly want to get. It's a blurb coon. Right, guys, wait here. I got some stuff to do. Sludge Wave! There you go, TR78. Not too shabby. I'll take this as well if you don't mind. Sorry, sorry about that, Lilligant. Right, we'll get, we'll get, we'll get back to, we'll get back to helping you out now. You still here? Yes, you are. Good. All right. Okay, so the Persimmon was over there. There is actually a Pokeball there, which I do want to get. So I don't know what it's going to be. Oh, it's a Hyper Potion. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. All right. Yeah, that's where the Venipedes were. Come on. Yep, you're still falling behind us. Hops just over here. There we go. We have found uh, a a parent, probably the mother. Wouldn't surprise me. It is a Pokemon game after all. Finally, Mastrath, and you found Lilligant. God, it must be terrible trying to be these Pokemon. They can't even walk properly. They got like hop around. Uh. <laughs> it looks like they're both pretty happy to see each other. Gan 2. Is that supposed to be... Uh, is that Lilligant for thank you, I'm guessing? Yeah, I just said that, Hop. Lily. No, I told you she's from another game. Huh? Is this some of the nectar from your flower, Lilligant? Gan to Till Lil. Was Till Lil supposed to be like Toodle Pip or something like that? Something like goodbye. Oh well. See ya, Petal Lil. Silly, see ya, Lilligant. Nice one, Mastraff. Now we've got some of Lilligant's nectar. Hopefully, this nectar is sweet and sick and sticky, just like Urshifu likes it. Sharp. Hmm, I definitely wouldn't call it very sticky. It's 
pretty watery. I don't think this is what we need, mate, but at least we did a good deed anyway. Come on, let's give Applin's Nectar a try next. Thought we've got to try and find an Applin now. Alright. <clears throat> Alright, well. Let's see if we can follow Hop then. See if maybe we can find an Applin. There's a Pikachu. Again. No. Right. Well, if I were an Applin, where would I be? Well, I wouldn't be where the Bleeding Persimmon is, would I? Tangle is here as well. There's the Tangrowth again. You're right, mate. Yeah, you really don't want me to fight you. Even though you could probably beat Urshifu at this point. Ooh, there's an app. Quickly, make sure it doesn't have any malware with it. No! It's an Applin! Yay! Applin! We know, Hop, we've just discussed this. Up, up, away! I'm gonna, I'm gonna roll away. See ya, suckers. Applin, no wait. Are we just chasing down Pokemon for their bodily fluids now? Hop, you sicko! This is rotten. I don't see that Applin anywhere. But I'm sure it went rolling off this way. Mastrath, we gotta find that Applin. Why do I believe the tree? Yep, yeah, it's in the tree. Huh? Something wrong with that berry tree? Well, it is an applin based off an apple. Apples grow on trees, so if I had to pick it, it would be in a tree. Also, in hindsight, we've just seen it at the top of the tree. P. It's having a piss in the tree as well. So we know that much. Ouch, the apple clocked you right on the head. Oh, I got smacked in the face apparently by an apple in dropping. William Tell, I am not. Away, Lynn! Apple in away! <laughs> That's what it's gonna be. It ran off again! Uh, Mastrath, is your head feeling a bit. moist? That's gotta be Applin's nectar on you. Have you seen this hair? Uh, have I got sticky hair now? Thanks to you. It might have given us the slip, but at least we still got what we came for. Why are you... But is Applin's nectar sweet enough for Urshifu? Don't you dare try and lick my head. Well, like they say, the proof is in the pudding or the Applin, so let's give it a try. Don't lick my head. Did you just lick my head? Hmm. I don't think you describe it as sticky exactly. It's more like juice or something. Yeah, because it's an apple. Dummy. Lilligan's nectar wasn't it. Applin's nectar wasn't it. They weren't really sticky enough to be the sticky honey that Urshifu loves. Come to think of it, they aren't really honey at all, are they? No. We've, we went through this exactly what you need to make honey. I was thinking nectar and honey were the same thing. So I was looking for plants and flowers. But was I just barking up the wrong tree? Yes, you were. Peed. More of you, are they? Whoa, Venipede! I don't see one of those every day. Oh, trust me, mate. I see loads of them every day. It's cute looking, right? But it can produce a really thick, gooey poison inside its body, making it pretty dangerous. Oh, please tell me you're going to say about eating the poison. That's it! I'm stuck on Pokemon that produce nectar. What we really need is a Pokemon that uses some sort of nectar to produce something else. You just noticed? Yes! And when it comes to Pokemon that collect and stores up lots of nectar to make honey, well, the answer is obvious, right? Vespiquen? Combi? Yeah, beehive Pokemon. The beehive Pokemon's got to be the answer. I'm sure of it this time. And Vespiquen is the beehive Pokemon, right, Mastrath? Have you ever seen one? Yes. If we're talking about the Isle of Armor, I think we should find some on the island shaped like a honeycomb over in that big blue tower. 
Now that we know where we're going, I'm off! Don't make me wait, Mastrath! Cheers, Hop, for wasting my bloody time. <clears throat> Alright, guys. Well, looks like I'm going to go for a break here. But in the next episode of Let's Play Pokemon Sword, the Isle of Armor, looks like we're going to go and try and find a Vespiquen. I'll see you then.